Hello and welcome to our first lecture and video from this course on how to create graphics designs using a free online application called Crello. Now in this short introductory lecture we will talk a little bit about Crello, what it is, where you can access it, how to sign up for a new account and what you can do with it and the main things or elements that you'll have in your dashboard inside your account. So as we have previously stated, Crello is a free online cloud-based application. You can access it at the website that you can see here in our browser. And on the main page, this is what you should be seeing. Okay, there are a couple of informations related to Crello. They will tell you in this slider here, a couple of information related uh, to the type of graphics that you can create with Crello. The truth is that it's a very, very powerful ap application and it can help you in many cases. It doesn't matter if you want to use it for uh, personal purposes or for business purposes or for any other, other type of graphics goals that you have. Okay, it's a very, very powerful and useful application. Now, first things first, what you want to do, you'll see that in the top right corner, you will have an option to sign up. Click on that button, sign up, and you can either use the classical mode to sign up that means to uh, fill in your email address, your password, and to confirm your password and just to sign up. Or you can use your social media accounts because every big online platform has this option right now. So you can sign up with Facebook or with Google Plus so you don't have to go through all of the hustle to uh, fill in the form to create a new account, okay? This is the case for me. I've signed up with my Facebook account. If you have a Facebook account or a Google Plus account, I definitely recommend you to do that because it will save you some time. Now, what I will do so you guys can have a look on the inside is sign in. So you'll have the option to sign in and I will sign in with my Facebook account here. You will see that I will be quickly redirected. And this is how my Crello dashboard looks like. Okay, in the left side, I have the menu and here in the bigger part, in the right side, we have the option we have the option to create a new design and we have uh, some featured templates or pre-made, let's say, uh, type of projects. Okay, we have animated posts, Facebook posts. Anyway, these are the featured ones. You can see here that we have a button which says view all 47 formats. If you will click on this button, uh, you will see that uh, more options will appear to you. You just have to scroll down and you'll be able to see all of them. Okay, Twitter post, Instagram post, absolutely all of them. Bear with me for a couple of seconds because they are loading right now, as you can see. So we have social media posts. Uh, you will have them in categories. Okay, if you will scroll down, you will be able to see all of them. And the best part is email headers, banners, absolutely everything. The best part is, is that if you look in the upper part of your screen, of your dashboard, you will be able to select different categories and you will be redirected there. Covers and headers, marketing materials. So in order for you to be, uh, let's say, to, to have a, a much smoother user experience, they are separated in different categories related to what you want to do or what type of design you want to create. Maybe you want to create social media posts, you are an Instagram influencer, maybe you are doing covers and headers, you are working for a blog or you have a, a website. Maybe uh, you want to prepare some flyers for an event, you can do that as well. Or you work in advertising or you want to create Facebook ads, okay? You can do all these types of graphics, you just have to select the right type of pre-made templates from here. Okay, so this is how it works. Now, if we take a look at the left side menu, you have a section which is called My Projects. There you can access all your projects uh, and you can edit them. Then you have a section called Inspiration. In that section, you will find uh, different types of designs created by other users of Crello. Help and support if you need any help and support or account settings if you want to change some of the account settings. Now, previously, I've mentioned to you that uh, Crello also makes money with this platform. So it's not fully free in the sense in which you have some pro options or pro type of templates like the full HD video. So you can create uh, a full HD video, but you need the pro version of Crello. You have to pay for this or you can do Facebook video cover again, the pro version. You can uh, you can use this to, to create it. OK. So this is pretty much it. This is how uh, how Crello looks on the inside. This is how your dashboard will look on the inside. Now, the only thing that is left for you to do is go ahead, sign up for a new account 
and then in the next lecture you will see how to get started with creating a new graphic design. Thank you for watching and we are looking forward to see you in our next lecture.